Hi everyone, I have Princess here with me today. She is a Himalayan cat and we're going to be giving her a good bath and brush out, trimming her nails, cleaning her ears, brushing her teeth, and making sure that she is completely free of any mats that she may have. Um, I'm going to start by rinsing her off, make sure that she is fully saturated in water in order to get that shampoo really down to her skin. I'm going to be using that Arturo for Cats shampoo. Always want to make sure that you're using either a hypoallergenic shampoo or a shampoo that is specific for cats. I really like the brand Arturo, but I would have to say that my favorite shampoo for cats is definitely the Chubbs Bar. Uh, so go ahead and check that out. Uh, it gets all of that grease and dirt and grime off, so definitely is one of the best things to be using for cats, in my opinion. So here you can see she's just trying to climb all over me, being super cute. I'm just giving her a really good suds up, make sure she's all nice and clean. Uh, we don't want any grease to be left on her. You're going to make sure to wash the parts that are going to be pet the most, because those are the parts that get the greasiest. So we're just going to scrub her up for a minute, make sure she's all nice and clean. So you want to make sure that they are fully rinsed through, even though it is cat safe shampoo, uh, you still don't want to leave it on their skin so they can lick it off. And if you don't rinse them out fully, it can tend to dry out their skin and we definitely do not want that. So even if it takes that little bit of extra water, you just want to make sure that you are fully rinsing through. So as you can see, we've been giving her a good blow dry. She's doing really, really good, especially for a kitty. Uh, so we're giving her a good blow dry, making sure we get all those knots out, giving her a good comb. I'll go ahead and tag my comb below, as well as my Chris Christensen brush. Uh, it's definitely one of my favorite brushes that I use. Uh, make sure we comb behind her ears really well, trim around her paws, get those mats out. She had some mats on her chest that we had to shave out. Uh, unfortunately, they were too close to her skin to brush out, so the mom was okay with just shaving them. 
I'm going to brush her coat really nice, make her look all pretty to go home. Um, thank you guys for watching. Make sure to click to subscribe, and we will see you next time.